Uh, Co-creation, I believe, is not just an ethical responsibility of us social change managers, but also is important because it works. It works in the short term and it is sustainable. Because when you ask the person whom we are trying to influence to take on the ownership of behavior change, then they not only uh, get excited and motivated to do it, but they actually involve themselves into the social change process and make it sustainable in the long run. Are there examples? There are lots of examples of co-creation. Uh, I'll, I'll highlight one example. Uh, a team of uh, National University of Singapore researchers actually worked with migrant labor from Bangladesh in Singapore, where the issue was about work safety. When they went to the community and started working with them, they realized the real issue was not construction or work safety. It was more about the, kind, the quality of food that they were receiving from the vendors, which was influencing their productivity, their presentism. And so the entire campaign or intervention project then actually focused on supply chain management to ensure that the migrant labor at the construction sites got fresh, hygienic, good food, which influenced their health and of course, work productivity. So it was a win-win-win situation because the migrant labor, their employers, the government, were happy that the solution that they had come up with was to uh, empower the individuals, uh, the beneficiary, but also to uh, give benefit to the employer.